up guys, um, I know my last video was a little depressing, uh, let's just say I'm still getting over it, and, um, I just, I also wanted to thank, uh, everyone who's told me they love me and told me how much, uh, of an inspiration I am to them and how much, um, they care about me. I mean, honestly, all of your feedback from that video really, really touched me because I never knew I had so many followers, let alone any, like, I would consider friends I haven't even met yet. And, like, it just touched me so much and made me feel so much better about the situation because I know there's other people that aren't blood that could be my family as well as my friends. And I want to thank all of you for that. I'm sorry you had to see me like that. It was just like my uh, intentions to make a video that about basically what just happened, not even five minutes before making it of what happened and stuff. So I want to say thank you for helping me out. Um, basically, that's another thing I want to talk about. Uh, I'm gonna start making these videos a little cut out just so they're not that long because my internet isn't as fast as I hoped it would be. Um, basically family. Mainly my family isn't supportive, I'm pretty sure most of you have told me or s seen that. Uh, I do have an older brother, he basically, I want, uh, to be quite blunt, he doesn't claim me, and, um, basically, he's not, I don't know how to say it, he's just not the greatest brother, just because I'm really protective over my mom, even though she hurts me the most, I'd say, I'm still really protective of her and I care about her, but he hurts her more about everything and that just I'm just protective of my mom even though I know I shouldn't but I'm the type of person that's like even though you treat me bad I'm still gonna find a way to treat you the way you're supposed to be treated because I know you wouldn't like it if I treated you the way you treat me if that makes sense um my other family like basically we're all scattered and ever since like my grandma ended up having like issues after she found out basically what happened to my uncle um it's just something that really happened and kind of tore our entire family apart like my aunts my uncles my cousins my second cousin cousins pretty much all on my mom's side basically fell apart like we don't do anything for holidays anymore birthdays nothing and that's one thing that my mom says that is my fault. Uh, she says that I'm the reason the family is torn apart uh, for how I am and stuff. And that's kind of sad to say, but you know. Maybe I am, maybe I'm not, but if I am, then that's fucking stupid. But most of my family doesn't really accept me either way. Uh, for my dad's side, I'm not really close with any of them. One of my nieces, who's 28, something like that, she's asked me about it. Like, she just basically asked me, does your dad know? Are you sure? Basically the common questions, but she was- I feel- I felt like she was more supportive of it. But I haven't talked to her since, and... You know, if I could talk to her, I would, but I don't have her number or anything. It's just like... Yeah. I do have half-sisters, that's where she comes from, is where my half-sisters. And... I doubt any of my half-sisters would accept me, I mean... Basically, I'm the only black sheep in the family that I know of. I don't know any of my family that has uh, 
some sort of like abnormality towards the rest of my family, like sexuality or anything. Basically, none of my family has tattoos either. Like, we are completely... I, I really don't know how to say it, what kind of family we are. We're just... I, I want to say dull. <laughs> and I'm the black sheep. And that's really sad to say, because I am. <laughs> but, yeah. So basically, I'm screwed on, like, blood family, except for that one niece that I was telling you about. I just don't have her number or anything. And I'd be really hesitant to talk to her, because I don't want it to get to, like, my half-sisters, then come back on my dad, and then my dad telling the mom and stuff like that. So, yeah. Family is a big issue. So basically I can't live with any anyone family related which I know a lot of people have asked me why don't you live with like other people in your family and I'm like well the thing is I really have any family let alone accept me so yeah it's just mm -hmm. yeah so that's a family bit and this video is really long so my next video, which I will upload eventually, uh, it's on doctors and insurance and that kind of stuff. Okay.